Hi friends, in the last video we discussed about do you have an aim? In this video we are posing you 5 questions you must know before appearing for NEET exam. Definitely these 5 questions will check your preparation strategy is fine or not. Starting with the first question, what's the pattern of NEET exam? Whatever be the exam this is the most important question. You must be thorough with the pattern. As per 2017 exam notification, this exam is 3 hours offline multiple choice question exam comprising of 180 questions, 45 questions from physics, 45 questions from chemistry and 90 questions from biology comprising of botany and zoology. Each correct answer will fetch you 4 marks, each incorrect answer 1 mark will be deducted as negative mark. In total. This exam is a 720 marks exam. So this is a summary of NEET exam pattern. Moving into question number 2. What was the maximum mark of NEET 2017 and minimum mark for getting into the top rank? If your answer is I don't know, definitely you have a scope of improvement in your preparation strategy. You should be even thinking of the medical college that you are aiming for an admission. And you should even know the minimum mark and the maximum mark for getting an allotment in that medical college. This is an important question in your preparation strategy. This will definitely help you in answering more number of questions or not attempting as many questions that will reduce a negative mark possibility. This is for your information. Seven Ames and Chip Marpudishere is conducting separate exams. So you can apply for that also. Question number three. How much time I get to answer a question? Logically speaking, 180 questions, 180 minutes, so 1 minute per question. Is it so? Let's check with two questions. So this is from NEET 2017 question paper. Double fertilization is exhibited by gymnosperm, algae, fungi, angiosperm. This is a very direct simple question and the answer is angiosperm. And you will take less than 10 to 20 seconds for answering this question. Let's take another question. Adult human RPCs are enucleate. Which of the following statements are most appropriate explanation for this feature? So options are little bit confusing. One only D, two only A like that. So for answering this question, you should need more time than the previous question. Maybe one minute or more depending on the understanding of the concept. The answer is one only D. So you should be thorough with the different types of question patterns by referring through previous question papers. Which are the topics from which I can expect questions always? This is for your understanding in physics, optics and current electricity, in chemistry, organic chemistry and thermodynamics, in biology, photosynthesis and cellular respiration. So you can have many topics like this. So you should refer previous question paper and number it the questions from different topics and give weightage to the topic in accordance with the number of questions appearing from that topic and you should be thorough with that topic that will definitely help you remember each and every question is important next question how much questions that i prepare while reading between the lines let's take an example so this also from need 2017 the final proof for DNA as genetic material can from the experiments of Griffith transformation experiment, Hershey and Chase bacteriophage experiment, every McLeod and McCarty's that was actually a continuation of Griffith's transformation experiment and Harkov and Corana. You might be knowing all these experiments. The question is not about the experiment. It is about the sequence of experiment. Griffith's experiment was on 1928, Hershey and Chase 1952, every McLeod and McCarty that proved that DNA is a genetic material was on 1944. So the answer is 1952, the experiment of Hershey and Chase, whereas Harkov and Corona is associated with deciphering genetic code and also artificial synthesis of gene. Yep. This is what I meant about reading between the lines. While reading a paragraph, you should make as much questions as possible. So for understanding the different patterns, do as many mock tests as possible on a daily basis. That will keep you in pace with different patterns of questions in NEET exam. And finally, the most important thing and find time to relax is a very important point that you should consider. De-stress often 
and stay focused don't compare yourself with anyone you are not in competition with anyone but with yourself each day each hour you are improving a lot and you are chasing your dream that's it wishing you the very best you are with biology exams for you.com in association with neatbiology.co.in please subscribe share and like